You heard earlier in the year that flagship ABC program Q&A had taken a big hit in the ratings after making several changes to its presentation and the audience had well, more than halved. As well as shifting to a Thursday night, the show has been hosted by the young and very woke Hamish McDonald since February 2020. But after going missing from the show for several weeks, the ABC confirmed yesterday that McDonald's time in the chair was no more. Join me to discuss this move and more is media writer for The Australian, Sophie Ellsworth. Sophie, thank you for joining me. It's clear the woke agenda of the ABC has uh, seen their numbers tank. Do you hold out any hope that the next permanent Q&A host will encourage a diversity of opinion? Oh, look, Rita, I don't know if we'd go to that extreme, but what's happened here with Hamish McDonald? I mean, he has not uh, done that show a lot of favours at all. We've seen the ratings plummet this year. Uh, they had their lowest ever ratings in April of just 224,000 uh, viewers across the five metros. And the show's really been in dire straits since he took over from Tony Jones. Uh, and a lot of people are just tuning out of this nonsense that's on there every week with this far left green agenda, which has obviously gone so much that way that even the ABC types are tuning out. So they sent him <laughs> off yesterday with a press release saying, you know, it was all very nice and thank you, Hamish. And he said, oh, you're wonderful. But it's very telling, Rita, when he just walked out the front door and there was no farewell, nothing. He just went missing in action. Now he's gone. Interesting. It will be very interesting to see uh, where he pops up next. Uh, but, yeah, if you become too woke for the ABC audience, then you have gone too far. 